Welcome to our channel. Don't forget to subscribe and put likes, because your support is important for us. And here we go. In a landmark move, Hyundai Rotom Company, a leading South Korean manufacturer of defense equipment and locomotives, has secured a significant contract with Fabrica de Armas y Munitions del Ejercito, Fame SAC, a state-owned Peruvian company under the Ministry of Defense. This contract marks the first export of Hyundai Rotom's K8088 by 8 Armored Personnel Carrier, APC, vehicles, a cornerstone of the Korean Army's maneuver system, to a foreign nation. According to reports from the Korean Economic Daily, the contract entails the delivery of an initial batch of 30 K-808 wheeled armored vehicles to Peru, valued at approximately $60 million, with potential for up to 120 units in subsequent phases. The selection of the STX Corporation, Hyundai Rotom Consortium as the preferred bidder underscores Hyundai Rotom's growing prominence in the global defense market and represents Korea's maiden venture into armored vehicle sales to Latin America. The K-808, designed to navigate rugged terrains and challenging landscapes, serves as a robust eight-wheeled infantry transport vehicle, replacing its predecessor, the K-511A1, in the Korean Army's fleet. Hyundai Rotom emphasizes the K-808's adaptability to Peru's diverse topography, often referred to as the Roof of South America. Equipped with independently driven eight wheels, the K-808 boasts superior mobility, capable of traversing steep inclines, negotiating rough terrain, and fording shallow rivers with ease. Key features of the K-808 include its ability to surmount obstacles up to 40 centimeters high, traverse trenches up to 1.5 meters deep, and employ a water jet for amphibious operations. The vehicle's tactical tires, equipped with an automatic air pressure adjustment device known as CTIS, further enhance its performance in varied environments. In terms of protection, the K-808's hull offers resilience against small arms fire and artillery shell splinters, with additional armor options available for heightened defense. The vehicle accommodates up to 10 fully equipped soldiers in its troop compartment, with rear automatic ramps facilitating swift ingress and egress. Furthermore, an open-top turret armed with a 12.7mm heavy machine gun enhances the vehicle's offensive capabilities. Powered by a Hyundai turbocharged diesel engine generating 420 horsepower, coupled with a 7-speed automatic transmission, the K808 achieves a maximum road speed of 100 km per hour and boasts a range of 800 km. Its fully amphibious design, incorporating water jets, enables seamless transition between land and aquatic operations, with a maximum water speed of 8 km per hour. Each soldier within the K-808 is seated on anti-mine blast seats, ensuring enhanced safety in hazardous environments. Moreover, the vehicle features a central tire inflation system, run-flat tires, and a CBRN protection system, further fortifying its resilience in diverse combat scenarios. The recent agreement between Hyundai Rotom and Fame SAC not only signifies a significant milestone for Hyundai Rotom's export endeavors but also underscores the company's strategic vision to expand its footprint in the global defense systems market. With Peru's growing demand for armored vehicles amid evolving security challenges, Hyundai Rotom is poised to capitalize on emerging opportunities in the Latin American region. Beyond this venture, Hyundai Rotom continues to strengthen its international presence through strategic partnerships and lucrative contracts. Notably, the company's collaboration with Kongsberg Defense and Aerospace AS and its successful delivery of K-2 Black Panther combat tanks to Poland exemplify Hyundai Rotom's commitment to innovation and excellence in defense manufacturing. In parallel, the broader Korean defense industry is making significant strides in Latin America, with Hyundai Heavy Industries securing a landmark contract to construct warships for the Peruvian Navy, signaling a new era of collaboration and growth for Korean defense companies in the region. As Hyundai Rotom embarks on this historic journey with Peru, it reaffirms Korea's position as a formidable player in the global defense arena, driving innovation, and forging strategic partnerships to meet the evolving security needs of nations worldwide. That's all for now, see you later.